Hey guys, we're back again with Rover Builder. Last video, we completed mission one of world two. Um, it was a really fun level. It just required you to create like a crane type vehicle to lift this platform onto this block and create like a sloping uh, ramp in order for your rover to drive up and reach the uh, ending pad. So that was, um, that was a really fun level. Uh, today we're gonna be looking at mission two this is a collect the supply boxes type level. Um, so let's go ahead and just launch up our default rover here and see what kind of hazards await us in this level. So, oh, well, here's one block up on top of this here. Can I hit these? In the last level, these seem to be a little lighter than regular blocks. Um, this is going to be a problem. So, I can't fit in there. And even if I could, that is a very tight turn. Um, can we go around? I'm sure we can't. That would be silly to allow that. <laughs> and we're dead so it looks like there's just that one block um, it's one of the ones with the hole in the center so we can use some sort of spear to pick it up some sort of fork um, but I think the challenge is going to be getting inside this um, these little this little maze this little hallway section so in our last level, we used this. This was a pretty good setup for lifting up that um, that block, that platform. So it works pretty nice for um, being a crane. The only problem is this is the same vehicle we just drove with the crane attached. So we already know it's not going to fit in there. And I'm worried that if I remove this back end, we're going to tip over. Who cares? We're going to try it. Let's see, what do we want to do? I'm thinking of just making like a, a center wheel. This? Oh, that's not going to work. Need a little more room. So, three spaces. There we go. That's a little, maybe a little more centered. There we, there we go. Okay. So we'll just make this, <laughs> even though it looks silly, we'll make it look a little bit nicer by closing that off. Maybe, maybe do that. I don't know. I'm really, again, really worried that this is just going to tip over. Um, but let's try it out. So far, so good. Oh, of course. Our wheel is on backwards and nobody told me. And our wheel disappeared. That's great. All right, let's try this again. That's not too bad. I, I, while I think we can make it into the, into the hallways now, um, I have a feeling that making the turn once we're in there is going to be difficult. Okay. This is going to be a tight squeeze anyway. Just kind of Austin powers our way through here with our 100 point turn. Uh oh. 
Uh oh. Don't tip. Man, so we're we're making it there. It looks like. I just hope we can. Um, I hope we can get out of here. So far. So good. Now we're rubbing up against this a little bit. It's wanting to break, so we gotta be careful about that. I really need to fix that at some point. But if I would have extended that out so it didn't rub up, um, our wheelbase would be too big. So it would just we wouldn't even have been able to get in here. So I'm glad I didn't fix that yet. All right, hopefully this crane can actually reach us. And hopefully I don't tip over. Why can't I drive up there? All right, can I get that to... Do what I want it to? Probably not. So I'm trying to get the, uh, the last part of the crane to fold up and not down. I don't remember how I built it. I don't know if it's supposed to do that or what. These buttons are... The way I've got it set up, it's very difficult to remember which buttons do which. Oh no! Why? Why? Well, that's not going to make it easy. Okay, just stop flying around. All right, <laughs> we're just gonna have to go. That's the best. That's the best we're gonna do. But at least it's not gonna fall off. Hopefully, hopefully. Uh, this may have been a mistake. I, I should probably turn around. But if you've seen my last videos, you know how much I like having to do U-turns in these rovers. Oh, let's restart. I don't know. Do should I put two wheels on here? I don't know. I don't think I have enough room. You know, maybe I do. I've got an idea. This doing it this way should still allow us to get in there and get around the corners, um, but also allow or, you know, also help with. Uh, you know, not flipping over, so. Come on. Here we go. All right, we gotta make sure we don't bend the uh, this part of the crane too far so it doesn't, um, oh, that's, that's not good. That's gonna break. I can almost guarantee it. This part right here, I should have put like a brace from there diagonal down to to steady that a little bit more. Living on the edge. All right. So last time we kind of just had to. Nope. Wrong way. So let's lift this stuff up to get it out of the way. We kind of just had to force the rover into these hallways. That turn is going to be brutal getting back. Go 
Come on. Come on. There we go. Whoa, 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 whoa. Nice and easy. parking brake so I don't uh, slide backwards here. So we gotta remember don't extend that too far. Ooh, why are you jumping like that? We got it. There we go. All right, so let's lift this up and let's lower this just a little bit so we're not like too crazy top heavy. And all right, we're gonna do this the right way. We're gonna we're gonna U-turn. Such a pain getting this thing to turn around. I think it I think this platform is like causing my rover to spin a little bit every time I hit it so it's we're gonna get stuck nice and easy Good thing we don't have a, a time limit or like fuel or anything because there's no way, not with this vehicle, that we would make it. All right, here's turn that I'm thinking is going to be the most difficult. Come on. Don't get... St oh, we, we lost the block. That's fine. We're okay. As long as we can get out of here. Alright, maybe we, maybe we go reverse. We use this little, like, hopping... That, that's going on. Go. Oh, we're so close. Come on, block. Get out of our way. Oh, we did it. Okay, we're out and we're free. So now we just got to get the block again, which should be fairly easy. I'm hoping, as long as everything doesn't break. Nope, nope. Let me go up with that. I really need to find a better way uh, like this the steering that I have I, this is what I use for all the vehicles and it just it sucks I need to figure out a better system but 
there we go. Let's go ahead and stop. Put the box down nice and easy. Yeah, that was not too bad at all. Um, I still think that that, what, fourth level or something like that? Third or fourth level in the first world where we had to climb up that uh, center little island thing um, was much more difficult. It was maybe fifth level? Yeah, I think it was this one here. This little island thing that they had going on where I had to climb on top of that to get the box. Um, that was still the probably the one that took me the most time to complete. Um, so these these first two levels in the world two weren't weren't bad at all. Um, let's quickly take a glance at mission three. It is a collect the supply boxes. Um, I have a feeling there's going to be a box on here and a box on here. Now these don't look like they're static. Most likely we can maybe knock them over and then cross our fingers that the box doesn't fall down here. Um, but we will take a look at that next time. If you enjoyed that video, don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe to the channel. Thanks for watching. See you in the next one.